All right, guys, welcome back to day two of creating a no Nintendo online island in 30 days. It is Amoa, and we're going to see what Mr. Nook has to say to us today. And we have Leaf. Look at all those weeds. So at the end of yesterday's episode, I did go off. I did um, open the game up again. And we, I picked up basically all the re weeds I could access. A grand museum has opened up here on Mochi. So we have our museum. We have our museum. Like updated. And we have the shop. So what do we need here? I think this is uh, the plots. Yes, so this is the plots. So what we're gonna do in this today's episode, hopefully we're gonna grind for three stars. So that's gonna be very strenuous. Um, we wanna get three stars either by the end of this episode or the end of tomorrow's episode. So that is gonna be our main goal for like the immediate right now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna... I want to like have a dailies like um, Froggy Crossing did. Um, so what we're going to do is check our mail. Okay, so let's grab the things we bought again. All right, we're going to set our things down that we just picked up. Oh, how cute am I? I'm so cute. All right. Oh, let me open this. What did HH high end stereo? I'll place that right there. Yep, works for me. Let's dig up this fossil. We're gonna talk to our villagers. Axel is is he carrying a flower basket? You're so cute. Good morning, Want Getting an early start? I want to chat. Don't mind me, I'm just keeping the peace on Mochi. I try to do a few patrol jogs every day. You know, he doesn't really seem like a jock villager to me. Okay, Leaf, I'm coming for you. I'm selling all of these weeds right now. 17, bank and bank. I think I'm just gonna get it out of the way and talk to Tom Nook about the plots. Of course I overheard the call. You were speaking very loudly. Three interested parties and we already have Stu on the way. You know, I spent the night reflecting and uh, Stu's actually a great villager. I still don't think I like him more than Barreled, but for the theme I'm going for, it was like perfect to see him, so. Of course, yes, here I am in your hour of need, uh-huh, like I always am. I guess. All right, let's get the this, the needs to build this bridge. Um, Now where I'm gonna put the bridge, I don't know. And I should be very mindful about that because I'm not gonna be able to use treasure islands to, um, you know, get money to buy a lot of bridges so this bridge placing needs to be useful because i also don't think i'm going to want to spend money to demolish it in the future all right now let's find somewhere to put this sucker but first miles Oh, let's take a picture next to Nucky Boy really quick since, you know. Why is he looking at me like that? Oh, no. Hello? Do you have a problem? And then he proceeds to ignore me. I'm over it, Tom. I'm over it. 
oh you know what i'm going to be back for you i'm going to invest in so much produce because that's where the money's at and because um you could have a farm on kid core now let's look at the map we're just gonna do some <sighs> I am good. The thing is, I am going to be terraforming, but how much terraforming I'm going to feel like doing and how much time I'm going to have, that's the question. Because I'm thinking for this Kid Core Island, I want it to be a bit more structured, like for example, a bit more, how should I say, townish. So I think I'm going to put the bridge here. Yeah, that's cute. That'll work. And you know, with Kid Core, everything doesn't have to be cohesive. So I'm thinking I'm going to uh, lean towards like not using. Oh, a bee. Oh, a bee. Well, you know what? Fine. All right, let's tell Tom we placed this bridge. You know, I don't even think I finished my sentence, but I'm going to lean towards using different types of inclines and bridges and not like the same cohesive style because like kid core kids, they don't, you know, they like to do things the way they like to do things. And that's what I'm going to do. Yep, I set it up. I don't want to wait. What should I do? Of course. I'm ready. Okay, so he's gonna send me these recipes and what I'm gonna do to make my life easier is I'm just gonna go into my thingy and I'm going to favorite all of these so I don't have to remember them. All right, so as for placement of villagers, oh, there you are, Hazel. No, I have not learned reactions yet. Thank you, my love. I'm feeling so much joy from that. Was that lame? <laughs> oh, jeez. All right, let's get our miles for that. All right, so we still have to visit the cranny and visit the museum. There's so much to do today, but I want to play th place these plots down first, and then we're going to visit the cranny, and then we're going to visit the museum, and then we're going to grind for miles, which I'm going to do off camera, and then I'll probably like come back to hunt for the last two villagers. So I think I'm going to put two of the plots on either oh well actually i was gonna put abel's here yeah i was gonna put abel's there uh, maybe i will put the villagers on this side then on this side because i'm having like a vision so Alright, here's plot one. Let's place this barrel down. Submit. Alright, we put the we did that. So what we have to do now is craft some stone axes and uh, hit some rocks ooh money rock and gra and basically harvest more materials
Well, that's very unfortunate. Bloom. Bloom. And a nest. You better be money. All I want is money. Or maybe a kid core item. 5k, I'll take it. It's investing in whatever crop leaf is selling today. Balloon. Item. Item, maybe. Or glasses. I'll take glasses. A shirt. Oh, that's kind of cute. I might keep that on, actually. Now back to the grind. Oops. <laughs> and there we have it. Now we got to do the tedious task of picking all this up. See a balloon, another balloon, maybe a money balloon. Come to me. Another five K. Alright, I think I picked up all my materials, so I am going to craft, my inventory's a mess now, I'm going to craft a ladder, go up, get some weeds, make a hay bed, put it on Stu's plot, set down the other two plots, this is like the list, and I'm going to empty my pockets. I'm not going to sell these wasp nests because I'm hoping that I can get the, um, oh, what is that called? The beehive DIY or the hive DIY, whatever. I um, mean, I believe you need wasp nests to make them. So I'm going to hold on to those, hopefully. Um, I'm going to, yeah, empty my pockets and stuff. And then, yeah, so that's the plan for now. That's the immediate plan. All right, we're done. Let us just let this thing know we're done. Check exterior items. We're finished. So when we go inside and come back out, it should say stew. Um, also, no more Tom Nook. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, let me empty my pockets. I guess now is a better time as any to visit the tiny baby nooklings and sell these pears. We also get to see our girl Mabel. And they're going to have a conversation like they did not see me walk in the door. It's okay, I don't need acknowledgement whatsoever. It doesn't take two of you to talk to her. Someone can say welcome in, Moa. We got nice juicy stacks of ugly old pears for you. That's it. That's all you can offer me? Uh, I guess. Look at how many pairs we've sold already. 115. Okay, I want this hand cart. And I want this. Let me place these kits down. Should I put the peppy plot next to the lazy? I guess it doesn't really matter. kind of want to put the peppy on the far back cliff. I'm just kidding. I don't... Re I don't... I'm not too fond of the peppy villagers, if you couldn't tell. I mean, they're okay, but they get on my nerves, kind of. 
This is such a big space, but I'm gonna just put them here. I can always grind up the money to move them. I'm such a great deep sea diver. Yeah, let's do this before... Let's do it before I sell... Before I spend all my money on leaf. So, since I haven't collected this villager yet, I'm just gonna put these down as dropped items. So we don't accidentally autofill. Trust me, I've done it before. This is the spot. I'll just put them here and deal with it. Please don't call me again, Tom. Okay, good. Now means business, so I'm gonna empty my pockets again. All right, let's donate to Sir Tox a lot. Let's make a donation. Look at all of this we have to donate. Did I donate the tilapia already? Huh, money for me then. I want to sell all this junk in my pockets. Ninety-eight K. I mean ninety-eight hundred, I'll take it. I'll take it, I'll take it. Alright. We're going to buy some stuff. I'm back, Leaf. Sell me something. What do you have? Tomatoes! Bright and red, just like my my mom's apples. I'm here for it. We got some mums and pansies. So it looks like we're only buying three types of flowers today. But first things first, sell me all your tomatoes. Okay, I just spent like a ton of my money on leaf right now. Um... Was it a good idea? Yes, it was. And no one can tell me different. So I need to find somewhere. Do I even have, you know, I don't even have a watering can recipe yet. Do I? Wait, you know what? I might actually ignore me. I might. I don't really listen to Tom Nook half the time he talks to me. Okay, I do. Um, yeah, so the tragic thing is I bought... 30 tomato starts and um only have the recipe for the flimsy watering can now i'm wondering do i want to waste my miles on no i don't i don't we need nook miles tickets i'm not gonna waste my miles on the pretty good recipes tools i'm just gonna i'm just gonna cry about it as i water each Tomato start one by one by one. <laughs> oh, I love that for me. But first things first, let's plant some flowers. From Drift, my main man is teaching me how to make firewood. I'll take it. I'm going to plant these carrots and then, I mean, I keep calling them carrots because my first, the first thing Leaf sold me on New Dawn, my hardcore mode island was carrots. And so right now I have like a ton of carrots, but um, I'm going to plant these, water them. I'll probably plant them right here. Yeah, I'll probably plant them right here. Um, I'm going to plant them and water them. And grind. F and after that, I think I'm going to grind for Nook Miles. See how many I can get so we can do this two villager hunt. 
and I will check in with you guys later today. Okay, <clears throat> it is much, much later. And so we, on our grind for Nook Miles, we also grind for Bells. I, I did like a ton of diving. I think I sold two or three pocketfuls of sea creatures because I want to pay off my loan before we go off it to the next day as well. But um, this is how many miles we got. So we're gonna we're gonna take out uh eight tickets and we're gonna do four tickets for each plot that's the plan so um yeah time to redeem a whole bunch of tickets that takes so long redeeming tickets one at a time um so we have our eight tickets Now, I think like a fool, my, um, okay, let me, I think I still have some pears somewhere. Also, while I was grinding, I started farming these butterflies, the blue bottle, and honestly, I don't even remember what this one is called, because I want to get models of them, especially this one, because that vibrant pink and blue, I think will be very useful for the island in the future like for builds let me see if i can find some some pairs in my inventory to sell really quick before they close up shop i'm gonna sell all these pairs and hope and just hope and pray that it can get me enough to um pay off my home loan before they close so I don't have to sell in the deposit box. What time is it? Oh, we have time. Okay, let's hope this makes, this makes an, we're literally at 97, like basically 98. We just need like 1K. <clears throat> oh yes, perfect. Full amount. And that is our home loan paid off. Awesome. All right, now let's go do a little villager hunting. Oh my gosh, wait. Our sister fruits apples? Hold on. Why did mom send me apples when our sister fruit is apples? She know? But is she no kid core? She's not really kid core. Oh, geez. Um, what do I do? <laughs> I'm gonna grab a ton of apples though because um, apples are the one, the fruit. Why did it have to be the sister fruit and not the main fruit? Why did mom send me apples when my sister fruit is apples? That doesn't usually happen. On, on my hardcore mode island, my fruit is cherries. Mom sent me peaches and my sister fruit is oranges. What is this sorcery? Does that mean I'm only gonna have access to two fruits on this island? That is scary. Yeah, so I'm not going to take Shino. Um, we're going to keep going. Oh, su Suspense Island. You know what I just realized? I didn't even look for my... Who is that? Oh. Not on your life am I taking an anteater. I refuse. I'll never do it. You can't pay me to take an anteater. Please be something good. I got a sucker fish earlier today. Oh my gosh. We'll never know. We will never know. Let's find the item since there's no one on this island. We could at least leave with an item. 
a cute chair, I literally scored. I mean, I might as well since no one's on this island. Um, what's up with me and islands with nobody on them? Nice. Plasma ball, not, not as nice. Alright, this is ticket number four. So technically, we should take whoever this is, because we'll be cutting into the other half of the hunt, but we haven't had good luck, so... You're kidding me. Are you joking? You're joking. Uh, what is this madness? I absolutely 100% refuse. Without a doubt. And you give me another plasma ball? You know what? <laughs> Orville, Wilbur, you guys, you guys are pushing my buttons and I have not seen one DIY so far. Not one. These islands are cursed. They're cursed. They are absolutely cursed. Okay, this is ticket number five. I'm begging you. Please be someone good. Maple! Maple is a cutie. She's... Maple is a cutie. Oh, I don't want this. We're gonna take Maple. We're gonna take Maple. She's cute. She's really cute. And honestly, she can she can fit in on Mochi. Move to my island, Maple. All right. So now we have the dreaded Peppy hunt. Um. So pray for me because we only have this ticket and two more to go through. And we have to hope that the Peppy is good. Bunny? I've absolutely never ever had Bunny before. And I'm thinking I take her. Honestly, I'm taking her first tree shaken and we got our furniture. It's fate. And it's a paper lantern? Come on to my island, bunny. You are the luckiest island I've been to all day. Oh, bunny is cute. I will take bunny. I've never had bunny. Literally every villager on my island so far I haven't had besides Hazel who I had on Mogu. So I'm loving this experience so far. I'll take Bunny. She seems like the peppy. She seems like the type of peppy that won't annoy me too easily. We came back with a nice haul. Let's go look at our haul. Hazel, you're about to have some great friends soon. Oh wait, we have to set these down first. We finished. Now let's go tell Tom Nook. Yes, fencing. Awesome, so we got that. And then I forgot to tell you guys, we met Pascal earlier and he gave us mermaid fence, which Honestly, I might use on this island if I ever find a pearl. <laughs> I think at this point, 
that is basically it for the night. Well, like for the day, I should say. So instead of time traveling to the next day, because it's pretty late and I'm pretty tired, <laughs> um, I think I'm going to call it an episode here. I know I said I was going to work towards three stars and that is what we're doing. So tomorrow for sure, I sound like Patrick, tomorrow for sure, <laughs> we will be working on getting three stars. So by, ep by the end of episode three, I want to have reached three stars, which means we're going to have to do a lot more grinding for Nook Miles. But other than that, thank you for watching episode two of the No Nintendo Online Challenge. This has been Moa on Mochi, and I will see you guys tomorrow.